Hey guys, it's Chris from Chris Productions, and today I'm going to be doing a video on Lego pick a brick stacking, everything you need to know about it, and 2x4s, a huge topic among especially YouTubers, um, and how to get them, how to get the most of them with your money, and what's the biggest bang for your buck, what pick a brick cups hold what, how what boxes hold, all these questions that you guys have, I'm going to answer them all. So. <laughs> Hopefully, and if you have any other ones, just drop a comment below and ask me because, and don't ask me really dumb stuff. You guys ask me like, where's my Lego store? Go to lego.com, lego.com, okay, I hope you guys know where that is. You guys go down to customer service at the bottom of the page, and you guys go store locator, Lego stores. Pick a brick is at Lego stores. It's also online, but then it's pricey, holy smokes. Studs are like, you know, eight cents or whatever, and here you can fill up a cup and get like, 5,000 of them and be like, what now? This would cost $200 on Lego Doc. Anyways, so this is my haul that I got, and you guys can go check out the haul video or if you came from the haul video. Um, yeah. But, anyways, so first I'm going to start out with small and large pick brick cups. There's two sizes. What you do is you go up to the pick brick wall if you really don't know this, and you fill the pick brick cups up with bricks. And now, these are really advanced cups, you know, I do a whole stacking technique, link in the description below if you guys want to know how to fit them 2x4s like this. But anyways, so let's just get on with this. Um, small cups, if you guys want to know what holds more, a small cup or a large cup, um, small cups hold exactly the same. Two small cups equals large cup. That's basically how it is. Now, some of you guys are like, what? Oh, but that's true. That's the truth. Large cup holds a bit more, um, but two cup, you know, it's a bit bigger, but then two small cups, you know, has that um, lid, it has the two lids, you know, to hide the stuff, and so they're pretty much equal, just, you know, by a little bit, I don't know, I'm pretty sure large cup wins, and depending, yeah, on how some Lego stores, I know one was like, it has to be within this much, you got some pretty good room there, other ones were like, one side has to be touching, and this time they were like, it has to be like this. I'm like, that's lame, and I know some Lego stores, it, just, it has to be sealed. So, I'm just going to, yeah, go with this. So, don't go with a small cup, because a small cup, I'm going to go with Canadian prices here, costs um, $10.99, large cup costs, costs $19.99, so two small cups is like $22, one large cup is $20. So you're spending two more dollars, but then you're getting two containers, um, so I know for myself, I'm almost tempted to spend those $2 because I need those containers for um, uh, stacking and just to have, um, you know, if I have a lesser amount of pieces that doesn't really take up a cup, for example, these pieces I'd love a small cup for because it doesn't take up the whole cup. Um, yeah. So now how many 2x4s? I'm, ju I'm just not even going to answer any more questions about small cups because nobody cares about them. Um, we've nailed that they're more expensive than large cups. So now a large cup pretty big right you know all good you can fit I now the, the number will be in the description below there's an exact most amount that you can get in a cup um, it might not be that accurate I know it's somewhere between 155 and like one basically 170 you know if you stretch the cup I know like I I actually put a maybe I can find it anyways I put a huge crack in a cup because I was trying to like force two by fours in it or one by fours in it so Anyways, but we won't talk about that. So, um, yeah. Um, yeah. So now, uh, how many... So you get that many in a cup. Now, you guys already know how many comes in a box? It's not actually an amount. It's it's kind of rough because their Lego doesn't even have to sell these to us. They choose to sell this to us. Um, it's actually the store owner's choice most of the time. So, you know, they don't really have to. And that's why it's not really an exact number. It's why they don't sell it like cups. You know, you can actually go buy these at Legoland for storage. I think they're like two bucks a cup. But anyways, for a large cup and a dollar for small. Oh, yes, I know that. That's American price. There's no Legolands in Canada. So, um, yeah. Anyways, but uh, my box, one box had a different amount from the other, which means that they're all probably like that. Um, so this one had 645 bricks. Only 645 bricks in this huge box. This one had 656. So, you know, a bit better. Um, or maybe that's a bit worse. Oh, no, the other one had 668. Never mind, sorry. Got that, like, minus 14 wrong or whatever. <sighs> Anyways, so, 
Um, yeah, that's how many two I first get in a box right there. So two boxes only got me like a thousand two hundred and eighty or something like that. Thousand two hundred nine. So really, it was not as many as I hope. I was hoping for at least a thousand a box, you know. So now when we do the cost, um, Canadian price is twenty dollars a cup. So I got four cups. That literally got me a whole box of two by fours using this technique. A whole box, you guys. Box. Now apart from, I think I took out like maybe. I took out a few because I put some, um, I did the math and it's, I put a few 2x6s in, you know, you could replace 2x4s, so, because I wanted a few 2x6s, just, for, you know, for a bit of structural things, I like to have a bit of a mix, I know for my, I, anyways, so, um, but, yeah, so, you're looking at the price, this cost $91 Canadian, 70 US, or 75 US, sorry, cups cost 15 US, 20 Canadian, the amounts are pretty much the same, the ranges, you know, um, from cup to the ratio cup to box price. So if you can fit um, all the into yeah four cups, um, either one, you are saving money on cups. So large cup is our winner overall. If you use this brick stacking strategy, go with cups. They are the winner. They're the best price. You get your best bang for your buck this way. Now. What if you don't have time? Go with the boxes, of course. But, you know, this way, not just are you getting as many, if not, you know, you're saving like 10 bucks. You're saving enough money to buy a small cup. Yay! Oh, wait. It costs one more dollar. No! Um, yeah. But not just you get all the bricks, but you also get crack fillers. Well, I should have said other bricks, a.k.a. crack fillers. Because, and for me, I chose these one-by-one one lime green studs. You know, I fit a... This was my kind of lousy cup. Um... After that, I got better, put some in the top, put some tiles, and then I put some plates, and I got some other bricks that are actually pretty high off the cup, um, cause my, but my store, this store here was still pretty strict. Um, yeah, so anyways, but that's that's how you do it, so go check out the brick from Bothan's form below, failure in speech, um, below, and um, yeah, so I hope that helps you guys. So next time we go to the Lego store, just um, large cup it. And if you guys, you know, if you guys don't have the money, uh, you know, then going with a small cup would be fine or whatever. But just boxes don't do it. Now that's two by fours, other bricks, plates. I do not know. Um, honestly, I I just don't know. So that's really up to you guys if you want to do a box of the other stuff. But here's my advice: anybody who wants two by fours, right here, go with cups. Cups are the best. So um. And, you know, I did not use, like, the, I didn't print off the page on the form or whatever, you know. I got some in the lid here, and then I did this myself, just kind of looked at the cup size, built it as I went, and then I just copied it for three other cups. So, that's how you guys would probably do this whole pick a brick thing the best, the most efficiently, and you get the most of your money. So, I hope that helps you guys. Um, please thumbs up this video, you know, like it, favorite it, you can share it to your friends if they care about Lego, hopefully. <laughs> Um, you know, if they do actually want to go to the Lego store, then you might want to share it with your friends. But, I probably don't even notice that. But anyways, let's subscribe. And if you guys want to see some of my awesome bases, if you haven't ever watched my videos before. So thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, and bye.